So yeah, tonight we embark on the hopefully pretty quick journey um, on what happens when you try to do the main story of Vault New Vegas that you've kind of started, but um, after you killed the Legion after Lonesome Road DLC challenge. Yeah, there we are. I mean, this is an this is a pretty appropriate outfit to wear because we killed Caesar's Legion and then we are wearing its corpse around the Mojave. So what do we have to do in the actual game? Um, talk to Mr. House. I guess. This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? You've come a long ways, literally, and I suspect figuratively as well. Yes. I have to ask, now that you've reached your destination, what do you make of what you see? Hmm. I prefer the wasteland, to be honest. You aren't going to ramble on about the virtues of life out in the wastes, yes, are you? I am. It's a desert, you do realize. Mm -hmm. A radioactive desert where humans subsist in a barbaric state. Difficult to glorify convincingly. They are, however, aptly named. For that's what you'd be out there, wasted. Here on the Strip, your talents can be put to use. I feel like a lot of people on the Strip are wasted, but... Um, what are you talking about? I'm just a courier. After what we went through with Ulysses going on and on about the value of a courier bringing about like life-changing events, we'll just say, can we get down to business? The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me, and I want it recovered. Okay. Simple okay. enough. Mm-hmm. Uh, what do you propose? My only concern is the recovery of the Platinum Chip. What happens to Benny, I leave to your discretion. Wait, where will Benny run away to? When you bring the chip to me, I will pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? That's fine. So, if Benny, if we go up to the hotel room with Benny and we let him escape, he runs away and he's at, he ends up being at the Legion camp. If there's no Legion camp, where does he go? We're about to find out. Um, okay, that's fine. A thousand caps. Well enough. I'm rich, I don't care. Return to me when you have the platinum chip in your possession. Any final matters for us to discuss? Mm, nope. I'll return when I have the chip. Until then. We can get Benny pretty easily, Black Widowed. Uh, we won't kill him, we'll let him escape. But we can get him up to his room pretty easily. Because look at this sexy beast. Hey, Benny. What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the groove, hey? Smooth moves, smooth. Hello. That broad everyone saw go in the Lucky 38, that was you? Oh, shit. Uh, when you shot me, you ran off so fast, I never got your name. You making a pass at me, sister? Mm-hmm. Because I'm out of your league. Is it wrong to want a guy who'd shoot me in the head? Did those bullets scramble your egg? They did. Or have you always been a naughty broad? I'm also that. Uh, girls like bad boys, and you've been downright awful. You're one sick pussycat, baby. There's Quinns, and then there's... I don't even know what to call you. I'm saying I dig you, despite it all. What do you say? I hear dig from you, babe, and all I can think of is a shovel. How can this be? This ain't forgiveness. It's something... wrong. I'm a courier, remember? Don't you want me to handle your package? All right, honey baby. This is all kinds of wrong, but to my sweet it is. 13th floor. Don't keep me waiting. Beautiful. Let's go. Keep those hands where I can see. We're gonna... We're gonna see. We're also not doing Benny's yes, man. Benny's gonna show oh. you the tops. I hope you're built sturdy, you crazy broad. This is the worst voice acting slash writing in a video game that's ever existed. Are you ready? Let's do it. Um, let's see what you've been hiding under that checkered suit. More than you ever dreamed, baby. Gross. All right, guard your ears. You're platinum, pussycat. You know how to swing. Nice Charlies, too. Give him a shake for the Ben man, will you? Hello. Oh, that was a nice bit of hey hey, girly. You're a real ring-a-ding broad. Hold me, will you? I swear you wore me out. 
All right. We are not going to kill Benny in his sleep. Which, by the way, just uh, sunny lore. The first time I played this, I got Black Widow because I always get Black Widow. And I didn't know this was like a thing people didn't know you could do. I did this on my first playthrough. I killed him in his sleep because I always take Black Widow and I always play as a female character. Um, so, yeah. Didn't know that was not super well known. I mean, I think it is now, but anyway, go to sleep. All right. Shush, sir. Okay. All right. So he has run away. We got a note. We're about to meet Yes Man. Do we? I don't even care that we meet Yes Man, but I guess we can. Um, thanks for showing this cat the best hay haze he's ever, ever. Talk about platinum in the sack. Where'd you learn that 18 carat trick with the heels of your feet? You didn't just make my toes grow. Ugh. Um, and then basically he ran away. So, uh, that's what happened. So now I have to go tell Miss The oh. eyes of the mighty Kaisar are upon you. He admires your accomplishments and bestows upon you the exceptional gift of his mark. Any crimes you may have perpetrated against the Legion are hereby forgiven. Okay. Kaisar will not extend this mercy a second time. So Volpe's in Colton. My lord requires your presence at his camp at Fortification Hill. His mark will guarantee your safe conduct through our lands. His camp doesn't exist anymore. Incidentally, it will interest you to know that the man you seek has fled the Strip and is likely making haste for Kaisar's camp as we speak. Those don't exist anymore, though. Uh... Okay, fine. Yeah, I accept. Seek Kaisar by way of Cottonwood Cove, south of Nelson. The Corsor Lucullus will be waiting. Will he? How is this possible? <gasps> it's a different camp. Well, that's not as exciting then. I thought we were doing a fun experiment. That makes me sad. Well, what did we bomb then if the fort is still there? Wale. Um, let's just do yes man ending then. That's really disappointing. I got super excited that we were gonna break the game in some way. Kill Benny asleep. Alright. Oh. There we go. Hello, sir. I'll take that. Uh, can I please have the chip? Thank you. Thank you so much. That's great. Hey! Hi there! Good to meet you. What can I do for you today? Um, who are you? What are you doing here? Good question! My function is to monitor Mr. House's data network and decode his encrypted transmissions. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a PDQ-88B Securitron, but you can call me Yes Man. Yes Man. <laughs> There we go. Look at that. Hold it right there. Don't you move. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? Drugs? Um, I didn't run through all that artillery to hear your stupid questions. Are you even human? Some kind of mutant? Maybe. Move a muscle now and I'll blow you to pieces. Okay. Um, can we move this along? I said stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. Okay. I'll take this from here. I'm Raquel, Master at Arms for the Nellis Homeland. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wishes to speak to you. Oh, All right. Coming right at us. Listen very closely and do as I say. Your life depends on it. Hand over everything you're. Um, no, we're not doing that. I'm not going to hand over everything I own to you and your tin can friends. You don't seem to understand how close you are to being erased from existence. Will you or will you not comply? I will not comply, no. Makes things simple for us. Okay. Jeez. I've got you now. Oh, you put your little helmet on? You put your little <laughs> helmet on? You think that's going to help you? That's not going to help you. I got unlimited impacts and this cool weapon from you, Listen, Don't even. Alright. 
Hi, E.D. You missed it. What? Oh, no. We're locked in. Do you have, uh... Do you have the... Do you have the, do you have the solution to that? Anybody? Anybody? Here we go. If I could, I could make myself a companion. Hello. Big Papa. So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? Um, nothing. Farewell. Okay, thank you. It's nice to meet you, sir. Who else? What are we missing? What are we missing? Is that it? Did we get all of them? Oh, the Omertas. I forgot the Omertas. Oh, I want to ignore the Omertas. Perfect. Don't you just love that platinum chip? Buzzes with power and possibilities, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. If I were you, I'd almost want to deliver the chip to Mr. House, just to learn all its tricks. That is, unless you want to bring the NCR or Caesar's Legion to power, I wouldn't want to tell you what to do. That's very nice. Um, should I ask the tribes if they'll support an independent Vegas? Oh no, I didn't mean that. Who needs their support? The Securitrons will be all the support you need. What I meant is, you should get to know these tribes and decide which ones you like and which you don't. You know, shape the future of Vegas. Choose your neighbors. If you like a tribe, leave it alone. I like everyone. Or if a tribe is nasty or going to be a problem, go ahead and exterminate it. It's whatever you want to do. Um, what tribe should I get to know? There's a bunch. I okay. And um, let's talk about the tribes. Of course, ask away. Return to the Brotherhood's bunker? No, they hate me there. Um, they can you can ignore the boomers. Then consider them ignored. If they end up firing their howitzers at us, we'll ignore that too. Until it goes away. That's one down, four to go. <laughs> um, we can ignore the great cons. If you say so, consider them filed away under not to be discussed again. That's two down, three to go. Um, we can ignore the Omertas. You got it. I won't say another word about them. That's three down, two to go. Um, why can't we ignore the Brotherhood of Steel? Oh, I know the Brotherhood. I want them left alone. Okay. Consider them forgotten. Along with the projections that predict they'll be our biggest enemy. They'll be fine. Forgotten. Wonderful. That's four down, just one to go. Um, what do you mean, the White Glove Society? From what I am, what do you Benny mean? didn't like them, though. He said they were creepy. Uh, I'll let you know when I'm done evaluating the White Glove Don't Society. Don't hurry on my account. I'm the one with a flexible schedule. Anything else I can help with? You do have a flexible schedule. All right, um, bye. Hope to see you soon. The White Glove Society has only just made itself known to the public, of course. But our pedigree was established over generations. Were we always so refined? <laughs> I'd be lying if I said yes. But I've always felt we were destined for a place atop modern society. And now, here we are. Not everyone can wear the finest clothes and eat the finest foods, obviously. That's just the reality we live in. But surely we can agree that the most tasteful, sophisticated people are the most deserving. Mm -hmm. and that's what the White Glove Society is all about. Did you say the White Glove Society? Um, okay, goodbye. Indeed. Does that count as getting to know them? It doesn't. What do we got to learn about the we're talking about its leaders? I just did. How may I be of service? Do you have any work that needs to be done, I guess? No, not from the likes of you, I'm afraid. I don't think you'd have the stomach for it. Okay. Better look elsewhere. Okay. Indeed. Interesting. Who... Who do we need to speak to? Oh, we did it. We've spoken. Okay. I'm disrespecting your casino. 
Because I hate you. I spoke to Mortimer. I say leave the White Glove Society alone. Say no more, say no more. If you say they're good, they're good. I say they're good. That accounts for all the tribes you needed to get to know. As soon as Mr. House is out of the way, things will be great. There'll be so much I can help you accomplish. Okay. Come back later if you need anything. Anything at all? Okay, let's go. Hello, sir. I already have the chip and I already talked to Yes Man. You've been a busy courier, haven't mm -hmm. you? You take your obligation to deliver a package very seriously. You listen to me that. For which I am grateful. I will admit, when you ignored my invitation, I predicted negative outcomes. But you have a way of exceeding expectations, don't you? Thank you. Well, enough. Let's have the chip then. Um, no, thank you. No. Hmm. How shall I put this? Hmm. Delivery of the platinum chip is non negotiable. I invite you to think carefully about what you do next. Standing alone before me, surrounded by my heavily armed Securitron guards. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm not going to give you the chip, but if you attack me, you risk destroying the chip. By the time I was 30 years old, I was a billionaire 30 times over. I founded and ran a vast economic empire. Mm -hmm. Do you really think I'm going to let an upstart come into my home and ransom my property to me? Mm -hmm. I spent two centuries searching for the platinum chip. It's my invention, my property, mine! Now be a good courier and deliver it! Hmm... No. I'm not afraid of you, and also the platinum chip belongs to me. The things I had to do to get this, you don't want to know. You needn't be afraid of me. It's my Securitrons that are going to kill you. Okay. Engaging target. Engaging target. What do you want to use to kill Mr. House? I love how everything literally is just like warning. This isn't good. Do you want to proceed? And you just say yes. And it's like, okay. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Hi, Mr. House. Nice to see you. We've met several times before. of preparation so much good undone good um yes man need you out of the way your vanity project doomed to fail okay um time for you to die mr house may there be a hell for you a Tartarus, bleak, unending. That's a pretty good one. Okay, bye, Mr. House. Hi, yes, man. Oh, hi again. Can I help you with something else? Mr. House is dead. I'm ready for you to join me at the Lucky 38. Mr. House is out of the picture, and you have the platinum chip? I do. Wonderful. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wait. Guard your ears, guys. Hi. This is big, huh? A very big moment. Mm -hmm. Here goes. I'll just take that platinum chip off your hands. Thanks. Wish me luck. Okay. Wow, Mr. House had quite a setup here. 
I can access his data banks and view telemetry on every Securitron on the network. Wait, so that's what the platinum chip does. Interesting. Mr. House had a whole demonstration planned for you. Just head downstairs to the lowest level to check it out. You'll see. I forgot about the demonstration. Why do I always forget about the demonstration? I hate the demonstration. Step closer to the... Wow, look at I this. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. You can come back up and see me or be on your way. I know you're a busy person. I am a busy person. I've left a poor impression on the community and maybe shunned from Caesar's Legion. Okay. Wow, that was a lot of text that was just on the screen. Hello. You did a super job wrapping things up, and I'm not just saying that because I have to. Yeah. Here's a printout with some additional information. Thank you. I love information. What did you just give me? Have I told you lately that you're my favorite person? You are. The reason I gave you this printout is I wanted to remind you that bunker Mr. House built over Fortification Hill. I was gonna say something out loud, but then I felt self-conscious because I feel really annoying when I repeat myself. Just to clarify, anytime you wanna repeat yourself, go right ahead. It's only a problem when I do it. Anyway, now that you've installed me on the Lucky 38 mainframe, I can peek into Mr. House's data and guess what? The underground facility over at the fort is super important. What Mr. House did over there was touch a huge number of Securitrons, hundreds of them. Imagine how powerful they'd be if they've upgraded to the Mark II OS. When the Legion attacks Hoover Dam, you could stick your army on them. And who deserves to have an army more than you? No one. Plus, an army of upgraded Securitrons would just be the thing to show the NCR that you mean business. Go away and stay away, NCR. The thing is, and I really hate admitting this, I can't upgrade the Securitrons over at the fort from here at the Lucky 38. I can't establish a reliable connection, and I'm sure it's somehow all my fault. But if you took the Platinum Chip to the fort, you could perform the upgrade yourself. Just a suggestion. Yes, man. Okay. How'd it go? Pretty good? You look okay. You look like it went okay. Hi, y'all. Do y'all want to get out? You can get out. I have the key. Our rangers are going to show everyone what happens when we're pissed off. Okay. Do you want to go? Please, ma'am. Take pity on us. Free us. I'm begging you. Give Mrs. Weathers the key from Canyon Runner. Thank you. There you go. I don't think we'll ever be able to repay you, but we'll do our best one day, once I found a place to settle. Okay. Bye. I'll come see y'all later. Hopefully we'll, we're able to travel to the fort. Yep, we are. All right. Well, this should take a while, so if you guys just want to, like... Another kill for my day. You know, just like, go get a snack or something. It's gonna take a while. something I can't Hello. you need something else what was that she won't talk to us probably because there's fighting going on you like that I do like this I like it very much thank you for asking Oh my god. Dude, you are dedicated. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to have to do that to you. 
Okay. Um, that's weird that I went in to the back of this I never seen. Will you talk to me now? Wait, where'd you go? Little child. I have your teddy bear. Little child. Oh no, she's gone and I have her teddy bear. And I was gonna I was gonna rip it apart in front of her face. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Yeah. Hi there, miss. Can I help you with something? So when you're not doing this version of this area, you can ask her some questions and she'll be like, I really want my teddy bear, but Anthony took it away. And then you go to Anthony and you get her teddy bear back. And then you go back to her and you're like, look, I found your teddy bear. And she's like, oh my God, you have my teddy bear. And you're, there's an option for you to rip it apart in front of her. And then she cries. Anyway. This junction box could be rewired to override the security door controls, disconnecting it from the automated security system and opening the door. Yeah, let's rewire it. Hi. Do y'all care? You apparently do not care. Of course we're going to upgrade the Securitrons. Move along, please. Insert the platinum chip and install the Mark II upgrade software. And then we don't even have to go see Caesar. I mean, we could kill Caesar. Should we go kill Caesar? Just for funsies? guys my hand is starting to hurt from the repetitive hold on <sighs> from the meleeing retribute all right they really they're like really wanting you to pay attention to that one did caesar go down he did. Caesar. Okay. Retribution. That's what I should be saying. Okay. There we go. So that's where we're going to end it up for tonight. Um, but I will see y'all tomorrow night. Uh, thanks for coming out. I hope you have a good rest of your evening. Bye, everybody.